everybody. This is a Doc back again with another video. This time I wanted to tell some of my subscribers about a new contest or a new promotion that's being run by the CAO company that is General Cigar and the CAO brand of cigars. What they're doing right now is that Rick Rodriguez has been down in Nicaragua and he's been working on some cigar blends and he's narrowed down the blends to three different cigars and he would like to call some of the fans of CAO cigars together to help him to choose the next blend. And it's called the Last Stick Standing Promotion. And this three pack of, of cigars is available to anybody that purchases six cigars at any of the participating retailers throughout the nation. If you buy any six CAO cigars at participating retailers, you're going to get this three pack for free. What this is, is the three blends that are being considered for the next CAO line of cigars and they've marked these cigars in code there are three cigars three different blends three different bands and the bands say C A and O pretty cool hey <laughs> uh, anyway so what you do then is you smoke the three cigars and then you leave your feedback on the dedicated website that goes with this particular promotion well, uh, I'm going to do it, and I can tell you for one thing, as a person that has attempted to blend cigars in the past, this is a very complicated, a very complex procedure in which you're trying to match a wrapper leaf and a binder leaf and three or four or five different filler leaves, put them all together and mesh them into something that just tastes wonderful and has all the aspects of great cigar. It ain't easy, believe me, it ain't easy. But I thought it was great because you're gonna have an opportunity not only to give your feedback about which of the cigars that you like best, but as a result of you putting in your feedback, you have an opportunity to win a box of the cigars that they eventually come out with and you have an opportunity to win an all expenses paid trip to Nicaragua, which I think is like way cool. So here's how you can get involved. First of all, you're going to go to the website that I showed you earlier on in this video and you're going to sign in. If you have a Facebook account, you can sign in using your Facebook account. If you don't, you can sign in right on the website. Once you're signed in, then you can rate the cigars. Of course, you have to smoke them first. I would recommend smoking them all within a short period, say all during one day or over the course of two days, so that you still have some comparisons to work with between these different cigars. But uh, be sure to cleanse your palate and give your uh, palate a rest before you smoke another cigar. In any case, what they're going to ask you to do is to rate these cigars based on their flavor, on their body, on their construction and your overall experience. And you're gonna rate these cigars on a scale between zero and 10 on each of those four categories. And then after that, you'll have a chance to type in some of your other thoughts and information. So if you, if you made it that far, you're gonna be actually involved in the team that produces a new cigar. And I think that's an exciting experience and I think it's something that everybody should try. Now, as far as the construction goes, when you're going to flavor, body, and construction, so construction starts before you even light the cigar. You can take a look at the cigar, you in, uh, put it in your hands and kind of squeeze it a little bit all the way up and down the shaft and around the cigar. You're looking for real obvious uh, soft spots especially. You're also looking for, you know, uh, too much lumpy, bumpy, you know, grumpy, dopey, and sleepy, you know, all that. All, all the imperfections that you can find in a cigar. So with that, that starts the construction before you even start to smoke it. After you've clipped the cigar and you give it some pre-light draws, that should tell you about how the, uh, the draw is going to be, and of course it draws a reflection of the construction. 
after that and you start smoking it the flavor really of course is your associations with other kinds of flavors of foods and other things that you've consumed so is that flavor reminding you of certain th things is it a strong flavor a light flavor it is a sweet flavor is it salty and so forth body is more about the texture and the feel of it in the palate and also in the nose if you have a t uh, re if you retrohale like i do so you're looking for the the fullness of how it sits on the tongue all through the palate and as it comes out the nose that's that's body they don't have one for strength and i usually separate out strength from body and flavor to me strength is is the nicotine hit that you get and you feel that from the inside out you know how the cigar affects you do you break out in a cold sweat do you get dizzy or is it, do you just get a nice mellow kind of a, a change in your emotional status that to me is strength in any case you may want to include those comments as you get a chance to type them out later so a, a cool promotion being put on by CAO for uh, you know pretty much everyone to give you a chance to become a CAO team member and get involved with the production of an, and testing of a new cigar. Until next time, this is a doc and I will catch you later.